Hello everyone, welcome back to Spiritual Lux Oracle. Thank you for your likes, your comments, and your subscribes. Let's get into this download because I was called to pick up the Starseed Oracle deck. Um, and I haven't used these since I've gotten these. And I was shuffling, shuffling, shuffling. And I'm getting, there was a spiritual battle that just happened for you, okay? And I specifically say for you because that's what this card says on here. There's a need for you to really pat yourself on the back because whatever you just went through, first off, there's Ascended Masters all through this read okay so you you and your spirit team hats off to you and spirit is wanting you to know that this happened for you this is not happening to you this is happening for you this is supposed to teach you something this is supposed to give you strength i'm hearing red bull give you wings okay this is a this is like because i'm seeing you know in the military when you get the little badges okay a badge of honor okay this is like another badge of honor for you because Whatever you just learned, whatever you just did, whatever you just practiced, is, this is something that you are meant to do, okay? Whatever you just went through, this is something that you're meant to help others through, okay? Something of that nature here. So let me put these on the table. Yeah, you are going through an awakening at this time. If you feel like things are shifting, yeah, things are aligning in your life. Spirit wants you to, um, at this time, write down what you want for yourself, okay? Um, but continue to surrender to, you know, their guidance here. But there is a sense of like your higher self is being born. Like you are literally about to be walking as your higher self. I'm seeing that quote, um, just decide who you want to be and show up as her. This is what you are doing right now. Okay, or it's like spirit is taking your soul to the next level. You are being initiated in some type of spiritual realm or something is going on. When I say you are being crowned, you are being crowned. Okay, I'm hearing goddess of light here. Okay, so you could have just decided that you are going to work with the light, that you are going to, um, you know, like you are going to partner with the divine. Okay, I cannot make this up. Pillar of light. Okay, you just walk through a portal of divinity. Oh my gosh. That like that word has literally been just a signifier for for whatever. Your vibration is rising. You are the oracle. For some of you, you literally just stepped into priestessness, priesthood, okay? Or oracle, whatever. Okay, you've become an oracle. Welcome to the family, honey bun. Some of y'all were not reaping rewards and whatever you were doing at first because you were meant to be of light. I'm getting when I said one time, it doesn't matter how far you go off. You can literally be playing with the devil. If you are chosen, you, every path will lead to God. That's what this is here. You were meant to be in those dark spaces because you were supposed to learn how to fight in those dark spaces. You were supposed to learn what you fight up against being a light worker here. Okay? It's like when you are a light worker, you can't help other people. You can't do black magic removal if you ain't never been through black magic. You can't you can't pinpoint in readings what's going on if you've never been through it, okay? And spirit needed you to go through whatever this was because the, the way that you are going to blossom, grow, evolve now is going to be majestic here, okay? And it's like, you could have even noticed in your appearance, it's like when you were in this dark energy, it's like you weren't manifesting, you weren't looking good, you weren't feeling good, okay? It's like things just kept happening. It's because you are supposed to transmute that energy. You are supposed to learn how to transmute that energy. You're about to become more beautiful, okay? Inwardly and outwardly, you're about to become more magnetic to the things that you desire. You're stepping into light, purification. There's a purification process happening to your soul at this time there is something that is going on with, with it's like you are and i'm literally seeing a spiritual council it's like you are going um forth or you are going ahead of a spiritual council okay to to and and there it's like the overview yeah warrior woman it's like okay you did this you did that you did this right you did that a little off you did it's like you are listen with this communication on the way it's like you are in active communication with your soul team and they are you are learning at this time spirit says you are learning at this time you are being initiated into priest priesthood I know I'm not saying it right, but that's what I'm getting. It's like, or you're just becoming an oracle. You are about to have access to the Akashic Records. You're about to be able to soar, 
Okay, I had a dream last night that I had two bites. I had two snake bites or two snakes literally stuck in my thighs right here. Okay, and usually my twin flame deciphers my dreams, but because he's a little bit, I'm a little ahead on the journey than him now at this point. It's like he can decipher it, but I know what it really pertains to. And I kept hearing, it's like in the dream, somebody else got bit by one snake and they took it out and it was like a golden glow around the snake. And I was like, why can't y'all take my snakes out? And we we have been fighting a war. Okay, we have been fighting a war. And it was like, we can't take those snakes out because they're warrior snakes. They're still alive and they symbolize you defeating some type of enemy. So it's like you've defeated some type of demonic entity. You've defeated some type of something that has given you this sort of power, this sort of truth, this sort of honor here. It's like you are now initiated. Okay, you have been initiated here. Welcome. Yeah, it's like. Now you know how to transmute energy. You know how to forgive. It's like, you, like, stop playing victim. I mean, who I'm speaking to now, you you already tapped in. But people play victim, 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 not knowing that God uses those experiences to teach you how to forgive. Okay, we need the dark to experience the night or the light. We need the light to experience the dark. It's just what it is. It's duality, okay? Someone has transcended to no longer, or transcended from no longer thinking it's good versus evil. We all work together. God is in control. God is in, in power. It doesn't matter what's going on outside of that, okay? One more spirit. acceptance you have literally been initiated you have been accepted okay you are now a child of god you are now working for god okay we're we're always children of god but when you step into this purpose when you step into this this gift that's when life really 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 gets good prepare for financial success Prepare to be more beautiful. Prepare to be more healthy. Prepare to be more vibrant here. Prepare to, to feel free. You're about to be walking on water here. Okay? Congratulations. Ciao.